Hi, I'm Dr. Reddy, Critical Care Consultant at Apollo Hospitals. Now my critical care team is going to demonstrate how to do proning. Proning is one important maneuver for acute respiratory distress syndrome patients. ARDS may be because of uh, any uh, vital pneumonia or any other uh, pathology can cause ARDS. In ARDS, when you are ventilating patients, sometimes you cannot oxygenate. There is, whenever there is a refractory hypoxemia, proning is very important to improve oxygenation so we are going to demonstrate proning uh, first we need to see uh, whether the patient ha has uh, a proper uh, pre-oxygenation uh, uh, we need to give 100% oxygen we need to see whether the all monitor attachments are properly uh, there or not ECG electrodes you have to change to new electrodes and we have to sedate and paralyze the patient and we have to if we have to take any blood samples before we have to take the blood samples and then we have to check the vitals we have to look at the pupils pupillary monitoring before proning is important we need to explain to the patient family members and then we have to take the consent for proning then you need uh, five people to do proning one person on the head end and two people on either side of the patient and one person will be monitoring uh, if there is any disconnection from the ventilator or any disconnection of the uh, tubings they will be monitoring and we need to disconnect unnecessary uh, tubes except uh, the uh, if the patient is on vasopressors or inotropes we need not disconnect that we have to continue and initially uh, one person whoever is there on the head end has to secure the endotracheal tube and we have to slide the patient with the help of other members we have to slide the patient to the right side and we need to keep two bolsters on the other side of the patient one near the chest one near the pelvis and we need to uh, uh, first bring the patient to the lateral position once everyone is ready then we have to prone the patient After proning, you have to make sure that the pressure points are taken care. The abdomen should be free. Wherever there is a pressure point, we need to take care of the pressure point by keeping uh, soft uh, pillows. And we need to take care of the head end. We need to take care of uh, eyes. We have to cover the eyes properly. And then we have to use a special pillow for the head positioning. In this COVID pandemic, we see a lot of COVID patients coming to intensive care unit with respiratory failure. When they develop respiratory failure, some of these patients may require mechanical ventilation. So with COVID acute respiratory distress syndrome on mechanical ventilation with high PEEP, when you are not able to maintain oxygenation, we have to go for early proning maneuver. When it comes to proning in COVID ARDS patient, we have to minimize the staff. Ideally, we require six people for proning, but when you are proning COVID patient, you may, you may do this with three or four staff and they have to wear a complete PPE, highest quality personal protective equipment and then they have to prone.